Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to do an ASOS haul and a Boohoo haul, so it's kind of like a mix. And at the start I'm going to start with ASOS haul. Now, from ASOS I bought quite a lot of stuff. I bought makeup and three pairs of shoes. However, the pairs of shoes I'm going to have to send back, which is so frustrating, because they are too small. And I have really big feet and yes, they really didn't fit me and I'm really sad because it was so beautiful. Anyway, the stuff I did buy and I'm going to keep is basically makeup products. And I'm going to start, basically two products I bought that were on sale. I've been wanting to try for a long time, um, but then they were on sale so I was like, it kind of pushed me to buy them. So the first one is the Rimmel Lasting Finish 25 Hour with Comfort Serum. SPF 20 in the shade light porcelain and it just looks like this. It's the red cap So you know how a Rimmel does blue red and orange. This is the red one I really put this on my skin. It smells amazing and it looks really good and I'm very very light-skinned So I think this is lighter than ivory. So yeah, that's that. The next item which was on sale uh, is this L'Oreal Paris lip paint and it's the matte range because obviously you can get the lacquers and the mattes and this is part of the matte range and I got it in the shade Apocalypse Red 205 and it basically you'd think it's like a tube you're wrong it actually comes out like this and it's like a little um what are these called the doofus doofus I don't know maybe basically apply it like that just screw it like oh my god I think it smells like Mmm, smells really nice, smells like candy. Mmm, smells really nice. So yeah, I totally recommend this. It looks really good. I do love L'Oreal. It's a great drugstore brand. And one of the other things I bought is the Flawless Mist and Fix Makeup Setting Spray Matte Finish by Barry M. And it just looks like this. It's a tiny little bottle. It is 50 milliliters. And they had dewy finish or the matte finish. Now, I'm a matte girl. I love my makeup looking matte and flawless and airbrushed. So, yeah. And I've heard a lot of good things about setting sprays. And I just thought this would be a really good way to start and build my way up from the setting spray world. And last makeup thing, more than the last thing I got from ASOS, other than the shoes, is this new Benefit Cheek Parade palette. Now, for me... I got this because I've never tried Hoola. I have never tried the Benefit blushes, which everybody raves about. And for me, I was just thinking, hmm, what's the best way to try Hoola, the bronzer and the blushes? And, you know, Benefit's blushes are like quite, I would say expensive, but they are, I think, 25 pounds or something per, per blush. And in here you get one, two, three, four, five, five. Um, it looks like this. And when you open it, it looks like this. So at the top you have hula, you have hula, normal hula, at the bottom you have hula light, then you have dandelion, California, rocketeer, and then you have this little brush. Okay, this is what I was gonna tell you guys. In England, Hula Light hasn't come out officially as a little little packet, as they normally do. Um, but I saw this in this package, and I thought, you know what, I'm really light-skinned. And the Hula normal one looks so dark. I just know I will look like I've just like swatched mud on my face. So yeah, and I'm just thinking, I mean, do you guys, let me know down below if you guys want me to like do a whole video on like my face using all this stuff in here. Because I would love for you guys to tell me if you like this would like me to try this or not because it is actually a new release so yeah now moving on to boohoo haul and uh, i got mainly clothes but the one item that i didn't get which was clothing was like candles which is so random especially from boohoo but yeah the candles i did get i actually took out the packaging sorry but yeah the stuff i got from boohoo i've used um, well i've got a few things but this is one of the things are these set of three candles and they're like part of the sweet candy range or something and this one is the Drumstick Raspberry and Milk. This is my favourite, by the way. <laughs> my second favourite is this Love Hearts one. And the last one is the Refreshers Lemon. Now, to be honest, I love them all. But <laughs> this is my least favourite because I have this thing about lemon smells. I really don't like them. I don't know why. The only reason why with that one I don't mind is because I find it quite sweet. So, yeah, that's why I don't mind it. Now, moving on to clothing. I bought... Hang on, let me count. 
No, I bought two tops. One kind of tunicky top. I think it's supposed to be a dress, but on me, it looks so short. You'd actually think it's a top. But yeah, I bought two tops, a tunic slash top, and I bought two kind of play suits. So they're kind of like evening-y and kind of like day kind of style. So yeah, the first two tops I got is this one, which is, <laughs> I don't actually know what the name of it's called. I call it the nibble top because it has so many like bitten up bits and it just looks like a mouse went through it. Um, but yeah, it's kind of like this dusty, kind of pastely, washed out pink and it has lots of nibbles in it <laughs> and it's a really i put it on and it's really really long it like covers booty and yeah and i think it's really pretty uh so yeah i got this in the size 22 which actually isn't my size but i like big baggy tops so yeah i got this from the plus size section by the way i do not know like i said in my previous boohoo haul i only stopped from the plus size section at the moment so if you guys are not plus size, I'm sorry. But if they do have it in the normal range, then fantastic. The next top I got is this, what are they called? Splice? I don't know what they're called. I mean, the, the tops that are split in half. But yeah, it's kind of like a choker. Oh my God, what the hell is going on over here? There's like a choker detail here. Like kind of like this. Oh, like this here. So it's like that there. And it's kind of like low cut. For me, it's not low cut, but <laughs> some people will be like, whoa, that's quite low. Uh, but yeah, this is kind of like a white t-shirt with like rolled up sleeves, which I actually only realized when I got it. It's really cute. And yeah, it's just white and it's like, it's got like rock something on it. Uh, blue and black, just pretty much, just really nice top. And this thing, right. This thing is so hard to get on. I tried it on and it is so hard to get off. <laughs> I do love it though, I think it looks nice. It is the weirdest design ever. Basically, it's like a cold shoulder here on one side. And on the other side, there's no cold shoulder. But instead, there's a turtleneck going over here. So it's not even a choker. It goes like all the way up to here. But yeah, this one just says, born to be wild. I think it's got skull, eagle. It's kind of like a motorcycle club, club kind of thing. But yeah, it's kind of like the same as this. It's quite, like if you, can like if you, if you could, guys could see, it kind of like... It's too short to be a dress, but it's like too long to be a t-shirt. So it's kind of like the in-between kind of tunicky kind of style. But yeah, that's that. Now the last two things are play suits, like I said. The first one is kind of this nudie, dusty rose. I don't know what this word is. I don't know what the name of it is. Maybe it says up here. No. Oh, it says rose, but it doesn't look like rose, but okay. <laughs> but yeah, it's basically kind of like this um, silky, stretchy kind of material. And yeah, and it just... And it just kind of like is short at the bottom. Now it looks really like a hot pant. Actually it goes quite low down. And then it's also off the shoulders, which is really, really pretty. I put it on and it'll be like nice as an accessory and stuff or like a nice little cardi. So I got it in this color. And because I love the style so much, I got it in black as well, which is like super cute. Uh, yeah. So basically I got two of those. Oh, I think I'm on sale by the way. Now guys, if you guys want, I'll, I'll li literally link down all the things I got from ASOS and from Boohoo. I'll also link the shoes uh, that I uh, purchased when I'm giving back. Uh, yeah, I'll link it all down below. But guys, thank you so much for watching. Um, thanks, like this video. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed, then subscribe. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye, love you all.